Okay, here we go again. Crypto Vlog, January 8th, 2023. Two days left. Looks like the approvals are coming in on Wednesday. It's going to be official, right? Wednesday, we're getting the ETF. It's pretty much done, a done deal. So the 194Bs, uh, sorry, the, the 19B4s are coming in. And they're all going to be approved on Wednesday. Are they going to post on the ETF, the SEC website first, possibly, or it's going to be a tweet? one of the other but in any regard the front run is, is insane bitcoin hit 47250 47250 dollars today numbers not seen since i believe 2021 since like september of 2021 right around there actually on the, on the way down was that january 2021 but such an incredible turn of events. Bitcoin looked dead a year ago, or uh, uh, 14 months ago during the FTX crash. It was $15,500, $550, somewhere around there, 541, I don't know. And now we're at $46,947, last I checked. Amazing pumps all around. among Bitcoin and alts. So, um, very few times, so we knew the, the ETF was coming. It was like 80% sure in October, October 23rd when the leak came out, the Cointelegraph leak that sent us first over 30K. 128k and now people didn't want to front run huma trades one of the greatest tweets the most underrated tweets of the last three months regarding bitcoin that said hey if, if whoa i'm like a teenager again hey if you're gonna um do the etf trade i plan to bought it yeah but I believe it's gonna get front run. So I'm gonna hedge. But he did close that, that's, that's a stick, that's a stick. He did close that hedge around 35K or so. The hedge from 28 and a half K. So again, he, he only wrote it like 20%, 25% ish. He didn't ride it the full 60 or 70%. But if you have millions in spot, millions in crypto, you don't even need leverage. You can just buy and hold. Again, it's it's a sweaty trade when you, you have seven or eight figures in a spot position too. It doesn't have to be leverage, but forget about leverage, holding that much in leverage. It's a crazy trade. You gotta get used to it. If, if you're right, 70% of the time, whatever, 60% of the time, then it's fine. But if you're over leveraged, and you're just taking a 50-50 trade, it's gonna be pretty risky. Risky business. And we don't like risky trades, right? It's not the name of this channel, Risky Trades. That's why I don't show a lot of trades. So, we had a little weekend volatility. I didn't do a vlog over the weekend. My last vlog is Friday, uploaded Saturday night. Or Sunday for some people. But, I don't like to trade during the weekends. It's all crazy, up and down.
What do you smell? You smell something good? Sometimes dogs like to smell poop. Humans like to smell good food. Uh, actually, some people like to smell the butt of the human species too. Here, but not really one of those people. So you gotta have a nose for it. And I, I don't have a nose for smelling butts. I like a lot of other smells though, and scents. So the weekend volatility came, 44K, went up to like 44.3K, then down to 43.1K, 8K or something on Sunday night. And alts just got flushed. Some alts dropped like 20% or more. Uh, power, power to the people, which I didn't talk about. That dumped from $1.25, a crazy random pump, 3X, all the way down to 42 cents, 70% uh, dump. Or 67%. But Bonk went all the way down to 5-0, followed by 9-3-5. And then it pumped. It pumped today when Bitcoin went to 47k. Bonk pumped to 4-0-1-3. 4 0 then 1-3. Um, after the decimal point. 4 zeros after the decimal point. So a crazy... Um, what is that, a 40% bounce or so in bonk? Volatility, remember, volatility is king. And when you can predict the direction over 60% of the time, realistically over 50%, 55% of the time, but if you're good, good enough, like one of the elite traders to predict over 60% of the time, I think the highest elite, elite non-news traders can do like 70% of the time. Elite news traders can do 90% accuracy, but... Botters, 95% of the time. Something crazy like that. Win rate. Anyway, when you can predict with accuracy above random chance, above what a, a, a spermatozoa can predict, a random animal, right, or cell, then you have an edge and you can... Use that edge to your advantage and make as much money as you want. Okay? That's the goal. Use your edge to your advantage. GCR always said, what's your edge? Why are you gambling? What's your edge? And sometimes you just like to gamble. And if you're right more than half the time, sure, go ahead and gamble. 